What is going on fellow outlaws? Outlaw Gary here on the channel and today we are starting Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm super excited. I know a lot of you guys are waiting for this game. I'm going to shut up now. Let's get into the first 20, 30, 40 minutes. Here we go. Oh my goodness, dudes. This is so exciting. Red Dead Redemption 2. A game we've been waiting for for so long is finally here. I cannot believe I have my hands on the controller and I'm playing this game. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Oh. Arthur! Any luck? Oh, I shoot. found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town. Man, it ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! My goodness, dudes. I'm so excited. Okay, let's see how this plays out. I think at this point, chapter one, Coulter. I take control of Arthur Morgan. We have a little bit of uh, free story, yep. Bring him in here. Looks so nice. Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this, just for a short bit, and I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac, they may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But 
We are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're going to be, we're going to be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. This is crazy, hey, dude. You need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. Bye. All right. We, the first time we're controlling strong. Arthur Morgan, hold okay. X to match speed with Dutch. Come wow, on, dude. Let's go. Ain't Look sure at the snow. We're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Every time Stay the horse close. takes a step, we'll do our best to stick to the trail. The snow changes and gets impacted. It's crazy. In two days or more, like this now, oh, it has to blow over soon. Oh my God. Oh, we ride, boys! Oh my God! Bridge coming up. Take it easy. Can't believe we lost Davy too. But he's the last one, Arthur. A few no people war. have died a part of my we camp. It seems like those people warm and fed. The goal now is get them warm and fed. Worry about Pinkerton's right. tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. That's right. Hey. I think I see something up the path. Uh-oh. Immersion bars, here we go. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Micah, Found a Micah. little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go Ooh. see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, you didn't make it. I love parties. Dead, little Jenny. That's too bad. Davy was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is or <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. God, this game is so pretty. We haven't even seen a lot. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Didn't see much of anything once this storm came. John, where you at, John? He hasn't seen him. He'll be fine. Things always turn out right for that boy. I hope Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. Nice. I can talk to Micah too. Oh wow, look at this. Let's do circle. You run into anybody else? I I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well. Don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're alright. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. Ain't much, but 
and shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk. Okay. Oh, we're here. Let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and stash those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Dang. Oh. Pretty big farmhouse. Okay. Let's head down there. He said turn off the lanterns, but he left his lantern on. I see what Dutch is doing over here. Health is displayed in the lower left corner above your mini-map. Cool. We're at half health right now. Oof. I'm gonna hide the horses here. I'm just, I don't know how horses really work in real life, but man, like, these horses must be freezing, dude. Let Holy. Let do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. They're having a- they're having a party! Holy! Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. That's true. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. Oh, man. Dang, dude, this is nice. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Hello? Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. <laughs> folks. There's a corpse right here. Now, I, I just Arthur. need some... There's a body in the wagon. I hear you. Just Gentlemen, keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. I think you should go now, buddy. You shoot him? Now, friend. I ain't asking. I'm not gonna wait. I'm not gonna much. shoot until I absolutely Please. have to. I am kind of desperate. Hey, I don't believe it. Come here, partner. Come here! It's goddamn Dutch Vandermark! Oh, shit! Look out! This yep, I knew it. Why isn't it shooting? Oh, there we go. Up top, too? Dang. Peek again, mister. Peek again. Oh, there's one right here. There's one in the bathroom the whole time? This guy's not dying, holy! This guy would never make it running like this. My goodness. Okay, so... I Micah, see. Go bring the horses closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Why would these guys just start shooting automatically? Like that? That's crazy. They automatically knew Smells who like we were. Party in here. Turn the place upside down. Grab as many supplies as you can. We're, so this is our first Please robbery. This is our first heist. Food, our like medicine, it's whiskey. Dang. We're already like jumping into it. Like first thing we do is get into a huge fight. And now we're robbing the place. Oh, Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. Wanting Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Let's take this. Uh, looks like the poor bastard was married, too. Oh, what? Look at my little hop. If we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. Ugh, starving. You should eat something now. Oh. Get your strength up for the rock. Hide back. Now let's eat some oat cakes. Okay. So you refill your health by just... Wait, does this let me take pictures? Place is dry. Oh, it's first person. We could maybe move the women oh. and Jack down here. Maybe. Very nice. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Almost full. Let's search this cabinet real quick. 
Oh, that's what we're talking about, dude. Look at all this medicine. We're in business. That's everything from the medicine cabinet we can take. Okay. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Let's check uh, over here. Meet me out here when you're done. And vegetables. Nice. Lots of food here for us. That's good. Baked beans. Let's go. What do we got down here? More food. Let's go, dudes. This is exciting. And these guys were having a party. They had like unlimited amount of food over here. There was a guy up here just shooting from up here, so. And we got some revolver bullets, too. Dang, we're looking good. So I killed the guy on the other side. Let's check the wardrobe. I don't think I... Oh, I can't check it. It's actually destroyed. I think I grabbed everything here. I actually don't even know how this guy got up there because there's no ladder. Hmm. And there's some blood. Lots of blood. And even tell you in the bottom right, blood. <laughs> just in case for somebody didn't know what that was. It's blood. All right, I guess that's everything. Let me, uh... Come on, Arthur. Get a move on. Almost forgot to check the chest somehow. I don't even know. I thought I had checked it, but I didn't. And I made a dollar and 26 cents. Let's get out of here. Micah, Wait a minute. Arthur, keep looking. Oops. Oops. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Sure. Can I go poop in here? I'm gonna check that barn over there. Anything over here? This guy said there's bodies here. Are you going to check that barn? All right, Dutch, I'm going, dude. There's a horse in here, it sounds like. Wow. What the dick? Oh my God. Bastard shot my cousin! Get the hell out of me! I'm gonna break your neck! What's going on? <laughs> What's going God on? Just jump me! Oh, oh, did he now? This is really easy. He's not even fighting back. Stinky <laughs> little bastard. Should I kill him? No. <laughs> not yet. Interrogate him. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Where is he? Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. Where's Colm, Driscoll? Uh, with the others. At an old mining camp southwest of here, near the lake. What are you bastards doing? Mm -hmm. Why are you up here? Uh, we're fixing to rob some train. Gonna blow the tracks. No, I don't know more than that, I swear. Ooh. <laughs> well, I would say it looks like you have this, Arthur. Do what Tell you me more. Do. I don't care. But bring that horse when you're done. Horse. What else you know? I don't know anything else. Please. All right. Please spare so me. I can spare him. I promise. You, right at you the beginning. See me again. Or choke him out. They don't tell me nothing, I swear. Guys, at the beginning of the game, I'm gonna spare him. Get the hell out of here. I'm gonna oh. spare him, dudes. I wanna see how what happens when I spare him. I wanna see what happens later in the game when I spare him. I feel like if I spare him, it allows for more things to happen later on, and if I kill him. It ends his story right there, so we won't know what happens. But if I spare him, you never know what will come from it. Look at my hat. Where's my hat? Ooh. This is this is Arthur's horse. At the horse. Yeah, good horsey. Yeah, that's it, boy. My first horse, dudes! Let's go! Alright, let's lead the horse. So this is Arthur Morgan's horse. Uh, we know this because we've seen it in, um, in different screenshots and videos. And uh, this is exactly the horse that we've seen from those... Uh, go, huh? so from those screenshots. 
this game is so beautiful dude i'm so excited oh we're gonna keep it we guys gonna lead him right here and hitch him what the hell do you think you're doing what the hell's happening inside? Oh, look what I found in the cellar. Why up there, ain't ya? Leave her alone. I wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh, you fool. Michael. Dang. Now, it is going to be okay. Burn down the whole we house. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Dang, what? Oh. This Micah guy is an idiot. Are you okay, miss? They came three days ago. And Father's been okay. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. No, you definitely can't stay there. The whole place has got burned down. Come with us. Arthur. Yes, it's okay. Uh, we're bad men. We ain't them. So, uh, it's okay. Uh, get on. Uh, we'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. That sucks, dude. We could have used this house to like stay warm and stuff. What's your name, Miss? Miss. Sucks. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler, Mrs. I, he, he was my husband. Oh. That guy dead right there is the husband. Rip. Hey, somebody's coming. Yeah, get ready. Looks like it's Dutch. Get ready, Smith. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back. How'd you get on? Uh, you think Micah Smith? found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Colm O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, uh, we found some of them there. Maybe I should have killed that guy. <laughs> about, apparently, scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food. And this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. We got a room, Miss Grimshaw. Here with the fellas over there. What? Now how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. Dude, this is so exciting. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong, and he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? How you doing, Abigail? I need you to... I I'm sorry. I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. John, I mean, John, John. He may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed, and he looked for me. Ooh. Thank you. Got the shotgun. Double barrel shotgun. This way. 
Best I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. Uh, wouldn't be the first time. I think I'm watching a movie. I'm drinking coffee from my Red Dead Redemption 2 mug. Hey, I see some smoke. Come on, let's take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, it seems somebody left recently. That way. Sure, well, come on there. All right, let's go get them, boys. There's some tracks leading to the river. Oh. See, they continue up that way. That's crazy, that bringing a horse water. through the water like this. Did the horse freeze? Do you think it's John? Oh, look, you the horse's me? health. Nice. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. You were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? What yeah, happened the money, on the boat? It seemed fine. And suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl. In a you see, I want to see first person on a way. horse. Let's check this out. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. <laughs> <laughs> now there is a setting we can turn on to remove the horse's head. We continue along the cliff wall here. This is crazy, dudes. This is crazy. It's so pretty. Davy got shot. Mac and John both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Can Damn activate Snow cinematic camera. Oh my! These tracks if we don't move fast. That's so cool. So you can activate the cinematic camera when you're on your horse and following an NPC, and you can change it by pressing R3. That's so cool. It's literally like a movie. And it's auto, it's like automatically, he's automatically riding because I'm holding X, so he automatically just follows uh, the NPC that you're with. So that's cool. Be careful, it's getting narrow here. I don't have to be careful, he's just following you, bud. <laughs> this is so pretty. As you guys can see, the storm is clearing up a little bit, which is odd because we're going up. So I guess the, it's a low storm yeah. or something? I'm not sure. A lot of fresh Blizzard snow. is, uh, is uh, I don't know subsiding, it looks like. There's not as much snow. Unless it's only, maybe it's only the cinematic view that looks like that. Maybe we'll pick up the trail again. We did lose the trail, though. As you can see, there's no trails around us. It's only us two. But it has been snowing, so you never know. All right, we're going to exit the cinematic view. My horse looks like he's dying. Over there. You see that? Nope. Over there. Oh, what is that? A dead body. Oh, that's awkward. John was riding that horse when we left Blackwater. That's not good. Let's see if he can hear us. He's over here. Come on. Up there. I hear him. He's over this hill. Don't worry, John. We're coming. Oh, now we have horse stamina. It's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who what? knows what's up ahead? Oh my goodness. Now I gotta go all the way back. Why didn't it say before I got off my horse? <laughs> Let's see. All right. Horse weapons, L1. Wait. All right, so I got the shotgun. Oh my goodness. This thing's deadly. The thing is, I'm a big fan of the shotgun, but if I have a shotgun, he has a shotgun. That's really close range weapons. Let's see what happens here, guys. I'm feeling some coyotes probably up here soon. Eh, it might be too cold for coyotes, actually. This is crazy. Go down this steep mountain like this. Where are we Watch going, out. Javier? 
you sure about this? <laughs> Coming from this way. Okay. Mierda, that we're high up here. You're telling me. Oh my god, if you're scared of heights, don't look down, dudes. Drops down here. Watch yourself. It's slippery, be careful. Stay low under here. So right now what it's doing, it's running you through all the necessities. Okay, running, here. crouching, uh, getting stuff off here. Real Stay oh, my stamina is empty. Up here. Come on. Because I'm freezing. Up here. Over here. That sounds closer now. Come on. Why don't you save those bullets? We're coming, John! Alright, dude. So I guess John's in this cave? Where's he at? How you doing? I'm miserable. I'm miserable. Been a tough few days? I know. Here. Take a drink of that. Thanks. I'm not ah, so this drinking snow. bourbon. Maintains your cores. So drinking and eating maintains your cores, health, and stamina. Got it. John! John, can you hear me? We missed you! John, where are you? John! John, you there? I'm here! Oh. Out on the ledge! That's Over here. John! We're coming! Over here! Over here somewhere. He's down here. Let's see what's going on. Is he stuck? Oh, is he hurt? Oh, dang. That's quite a scratch you got there. Oh. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Bro, he is jacked up, dudes. Holy. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. Broken leg, broken arm, it looks like. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. <laughs> Come on, compadre. This cinematic view is really nice. Holy! A wolf! See that on the oh! Ridge? A pack of wolves! Oh, baby! This is exciting. I'll distract him while you get to the horses. Go! Oh, Go baby. On. This is gonna be good. Right, John, come on. Javier and John. Let's get you on that horse. Come on, wolves, let's do it. Oh wait, they're over here. Oh, there they are. Come on over. Oh! Uh oh. Oh, baby. Oh, can we? Can I skin them? I can't skin them. But can I, hold on? Maybe. If I take out my knife? Oh, I can't. Just let me. Dang, dudes. That's so cool. I'm so excited! This is the prologue, dude. It lets you do everything you need to do to go ahead and play the game properly. And this so far has been so much fun. Get on the horse. Let's get out of here. Can I swing my knife when I have when I want a horse? I don't know why. <laughs> Let me put away my knife. I just have my knife out. God, this is so cool. John, hold on, brother. It's just like a, a dog bite. A really big dog bite. You knew a fella? Got bit by a dog. Died an hour later. Up there? Oh, you'll be kidding me. One. Ah! What the? My horse? What is happening? He's sliding! I can run him over my horse. Oh, thank goodness, because oh my god, my horse was sliding down the mountain. Don't think so. Oh, Jesus. I just jumped. You still with us, Marston? Did you see that? Just about. You're gonna be okay. We have some shelter now. Thanks for coming for me. 
course. What is this? That bullet in Blackwater, now this. You had a hell of a time. And Arthur Owens says I'm lucky. None of us can stay close. We don't want anyone else getting lost. None of us are lucky right now. We should ride in the water for a bit. Try to lose a scent. Don't want to leave a trail right back to camp. You know, we're gonna need to come up with a better story for that scar. So, freezing, bleeding, starving? Damn near getting eaten to death ain't good enough for you. This is so yeah. cool. Let's cross to the left. Yeah, come on. Let's push hard and get back. See those buildings up ahead, John? That's where we camped. Nearly there. Ooh. We're back at the camp. Dude, this is so cool. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the gameplay. If you guys are, make sure you guys drop a like. Let me know in the comment section what do you guys think of the game so far. We're just learning. I want to do like, I think I should do the first hour of the game. This is cool. We need some help. We need some help here. Come on, help him down. You're alive. You're alive. Here we go. There we go. Ay, careful, idiotas. It's his leg. Oh, come on, let's get you warm. Thank you. Thank you both. This is a new low, even by your standards. Thank you, Arthur. Thank you. You got any other lost maidens need saving? <laughs> Not today. Have you and Dutch talked about how we're going to get out of this? I was just discussing with Herr Strauss when the weather breaks. I suppose we'll have to keep heading east. East? Into all that? That civilization. I know. The West is where our problems are worse. Come on, Herr Strauss. Let's get warm. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'm a freaking hero, dudes. I'm a freaking hero. We have been running for weeks. We found shelter and been resting here in some old abandoned mining town while we wait the thaw. Hardly the spring I had been hoping for. Right, new journal entry. Old options for details. Get strong. We get warm. We wait. When the storm breaks, we move. But we're safe here. Warm enough. I guess. Woo wee! It is cold outside. So we've done most of the beginning of the game. We are still heading towards civilization right now let's go to open our map as you guys can see we have literally unlocked nothing <laughs> all of it's covered by fog of war and we have some work to do first order of business is to go ahead and talk to mr pearson he needs to speak to us i guess we're gonna learn how to hunt here and then uh if i speak to bill williamson well it looks like we're gonna go kill some old friends so Let's go talk to Bill. I wonder, can I catch on fire? I can't, but I guess. Stay alert there, Javier. Morning, Arthur. Morning, Arthur. Help with you, boys, because I thought you liked action. A couple of days on the lam, and you lot have all turned yellow. Apart from you, of course. Shut up, Micah. I ain't never seen so many long faces. Mm. I guess. I guess folks miss them. I fell, but when I fall, I don't want no fuss. When you fall, there'll be a party. <laughs> a party? <laughs> Probably. Uh -huh. Funny, huh? Sure. <laughs> I don't feel like being laughed at by the likes of you two. Stop it! Now! Micah is a troublemaker, dude. Each other when Como Driscoll's needing punching hard. You want to sit around waiting for him to come find us? All of you, we got work to do. Come on. Are you sure right. about this, Dutch? Yes. Both been through a lot recently. We hardly back on our feet yet. And the last thing we need is to get bushwhacked by Como Driscoll. Let's go. So we're gonna go I take out the Driscolls. Him, Dutch. He's here for us. I doubt that. No, nope, you're just doubting me. I would never doubt you, Dutch. You, you always said revenge is a luxury we can't afford. This is the right call, Arthur. Take this. And this is about more than revenge for business long ago. They were talking about trains and detonators. detonators. Here. Comb 
always had good information. Come on. And you think now is the right time to hit a train? Now you might fancy living on deer piss and rabbit shit. I'm getting too old for that life. Mr. Matthews, Mr. Smith, Mr. Pearson. Hold it down. You look after the place. There are O'Driscolls about. Yeah. Let's go, dudes. Southwest, right, Arthur? Yeah. He said follow. I'm the, the ride. Time Southwest. to ride. They're camped near some lake. Okay. Let's go find these bastards. Bro, this Order guy's horse next to me is so big. Holy. It's one of those like Clydesdale horses, I think. Thing's massive. Like a bear. So this is the cinematic view. So it's automatically they're just going. I don't have to do anything. Oh, something's gonna happen here. Tracks. Horses quite a Uh-oh, we found some tracks, dudes. As far as I can tell, the only fools out here are us and them. They must be this way. Dude, this is so cool. You good, Dutch? Of course. Listen. I know you don't think much of my ideas recently, but this is the right move. Okay. You know I got your back. I learned a long time ago that you hit Como Driscoll. Wait for him, the people you love will die. This feud between you and him needs to be put to rest. Turn off my webcam for now while we're doing this little riding scene. Just so you guys can feel immersed into the gameplay. Others I can't forget. What he did to Annabelle, I can't do neither. You killed his brother, Dutch. Yes, I did. And I hope the bastards will be reunited soon enough. That's how this will end. When I Damn bump right into boss. other people's horses, I can feel oh. it on my controller that I'm bumping into someone else's horse. And I believe my horse feels it as well. See that smoke? Let's cut up here and take a look. They said it was near the lake, so we must be close. Hold up here. Easy. <laughs> All right, gentlemen. This is it. Are we goddamn ready? Ready, ready. Dutch. Good. Now, Mr. Morgan and I, we're gonna head up here a little, see if we can't get a sense of the layout of the camp. Mr. Williamson, Mr. Bell, you two take up a hidden position just outside the camp. Mr. Summers, Mr. Escuela, you two hold position here. All right, boys, let's do it. Grab my rifle off the horse. I thought you were going with Dutch. Apparently I can't grab the rifle off my horse. I guess we're just scouting it out right now. There they are. That's definitely them. There's a lot of guys oh, here. Holy. I think so. Yeah, that's him. They're getting ready to go somewhere, I think. Yeah, they are. Who's he talking to? He don't seem very happy. No. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh! He's punching him. Is he gonna shoot him? Nope, he's not. They leaving? Seem to be. Should we go get him? No. Cone can wait. Best to get some of them out of there. And much less fun to rob him and his score if he never finds out about it. All right. Let's go pay our old friends a visit. Our first mission. Old friends a visit. This is gonna be. See how this goes. I totally went to go run and held R2 for some reason. Don't forget to grab that rifle from your horse. Oh, now I can grab the rifle. You see, I freaking knew it. You boys be ready to pick them off from up there. <laughs> sure thing. My God, you walk so slow in the snow. Can I just run, please? Oh, oh. Are you hearing me? We're gonna run rifle and revolver. Good. Come on, let's go. Yo, Dutch is such an a-hole. 
He's just... Seems easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said, revenge is a luxury we can't afford. Yeah, just wasn't sure you agreed with me. Arthur. Arthur, have you completely lost faith in me? Our needs right now are supplies, equipment, and a way out of here. Everything else, including calm, can wait. Okay. Okay. There's enough of those bastards down there to deal with as okay. it is. Now, come on. Maybe I should take the lead on this. They're going to be gunning for you. They ain't got me yet. No, but the way our luck's been running... Hush. Let's just get down there first. Follow me. Let's head for that building in front. Come on. Follow me. I hope he knifes him and doesn't shoot him. That's an easy stealth kill right there. Okay, let's get in cover. Oh wait, that's one of that's Mike, I think. So, what are we doing, Dutch? I can take this if you want. Just make the call. You want to take the lead? Go. All right. I know who I'm gonna gun for We're first. Move on this right now. Take the lead. Okay, I'll go first. I'm gunning for this guy all the way up here. I'm gonna use my rifle, actually. There we go, dudes. Let's go! Ah! How is that guy still alive? I just blew his brains away. Dang, I can't shoot him here. I blew up his hat! <laughs> I can't see this guy. Get up! Oh my god. There we go. This carbon repeater is so nice. I keep shooting off hats. I feel like I'm playing like a serious shooter right now. I'm just pushing like. Ooh, I took a nasty hit there. Ooh, he's bleeding out. That was a super overkill. That was a super overkill by far. <laughs> oh man. Cole doesn't give a damn about his men. All he cares about is numbers. You can shoot a gun and ride a horse and kill without thought. That was such an overkill. Think how long some of you have been with me. I imagine Cole doesn't even know half the names of these fools. Ooh, a dollar off that dude? Let's go. Heads up, boys. We got more. more guys? What? Ooh, a gold wedding ring. Let's go. Uh oh. He dead? He's dead. Let's defend. 
I like how he asks me what we should do every time. Oh god. Let me reload. Excuse me guys, don't mind me. There's so many of them too. Oh, dirty. He's dead. Most of these guys are all dead. Oh. My God, dudes. So I'll say, uh, shooting in Red Dead Redemption 2 is pretty fluid, but because I'm not a console player, I struggle a little bit, but it's easy adaptable. I think, I think over time I can figure it out. What I do like, if you guys look on the bottom left on the mini map, it shows you which bodies have and have not been looted. Because as you can imagine, probably keeping track of where all the bodies are that you kill might get a little hard. But this is a this was like a serious massacre, dude. Oops. I keep pressing R2 to, to run. I don't know why that's a that's a weird habit. I think that's because I play a lot of Spider-Man. That was the last spot. That was the last PS4 game I played was Spider-Man, so. I bet you guys are happy you're not like, oh, it, it was Fortnite. It wasn't Fortnite, guys. It's Spider-Man. I don't play Fortnite on PS4. Money is really good to find, I think. Ooh, can I pick up his hat? I should be able to pick up his hat. They're hats, I think. Or you can steal hats. I don't think you can pick it up dead bodies, can you? I don't know. I guess not. Ooh, chewing tobacco. Let's go. I don't know what that's good for, but maybe I can sell it. I will not be chewing tobacco unless it like alleviates stress or something. I feel like that's probably not good for my character. It might give me cancer. One thing I gotta make sure I do is loot all these guys and check the inside of the house. Dude, I'm getting freaking rich from these dudes. I've made probably like five bucks by now. This is great. I've been going all the freaking clubs with all. Look at this 17 bucks. I'm freaking rich. Good work, boys. Now, let's tear this place apart. Don't tell me they're about to light stuff on fire. You go search that wagon there. Mike, search that building. Arthur, you take that building to the left. All right, man, quick. Find those detonators, explosives, anything. Take everything. Can. Take give me let's everything. Go. Coin purse, give it give me all of it. Baked beans, let's go. Some crackers. Bro, we are getting so much stuff. Oh, I can't carry any more chewing tobacco. I have too much. Oh, dynamite? No way. Here. This looks good. What do you think, Bill? Well, looks fine. <laughs> Smells good. good. That's too easy. Dynamite right away? I love it. Did we get everything? I think so, boss. Found this on one of them. Thank you. Is that a map? This is perfect. Oh, yeah. Interesting. This is something about the train they oh, was gonna run. Dang. A Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Mount back up. Let's keep moving. No, wait, I didn't get to search everything. Wait, 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 wait. All right. Let's get out of here. Proud of you, dudes. boys. All of you. Well, Got a man down. Good work, fellas. I missed the guy over there, whatever. Starving down and out. I don't really, I guess I don't, I don't need everything here, but we did miss some stuff. We mostly got all the guys we needed to, and we went ahead and looted some of the buildings. So not too bad. Wait until we have John. I know. The next thing I have to do is go ahead and do the train robbery. You know, he'll come after us. Oh, of course he will, just like all the rest. But we're gonna stay a step ahead of them. Make sure we always know where they are before they know where we are. We allowed ourselves to get a step behind in Blackwater. That won't happen again. Leave him to me. All right, dude, let's chase this dude down. Sir, can you please pull over? This is the Red 
Red, Red Dead Redemption Police. This is the Haywater Police. This is the Arthur Morgan Police Department. What the hell's wrong with you? I don't. Am what I supposed? The hell did I, do? I, I, I don't know. Like, it says aim your weapon by pressing R2. He's not stopping though. Sir? Stay back. Sir? I'm gonna blow your back out. Like I could shoot out his horse. But like. Did that, did that just happen? Did that, did that seriously just happen? What just happened? Please don't kill me, please. I can beat him. Don't hurt me. <laughs> He's still alive. Get up. What is he doing? Hey. He dead now? Did he die? He's still alive. I think he's sleeping. Oh wait. Okay, apparently I'm supposed to hog tie him. It never even said that. It never said to do this. That's so weird. Why wouldn't it tell me to do this? I had to figure this out on my own. For some reason, it didn't let me know, like, hey, you should hog tie him. All right, let's throw him on the back. Ooh, can we grab his hat? Nope. All right. What's your name, boy? I don't know. You don't know your name? It's Kieran. Kieran what? Duffy. Kieran Duffy. Well, I ain't gonna lie to you. This is a real bad day for you, Kieran Duffy. Where are you taking me? Somewhere you ain't gonna like. Why? What are you gonna do to me? Some fan you ain't gonna like. So I'd advise you to save your breath for screaming. No, please. Let me go. I'll disappear. I'll go to Mexico. Ooh. Ooh. You'll go to Mexico? Don't do this, please. You better shut your mouth, you little shit, or I will shut it for you. All right, so we've returned back to camp. Got a nice little fire going. Let's drop this guy off and figure out what he is all about. Here we are, you sack of shit. Let's introduce you to the boys. Don't hurt me, please. Oh, don't worry. They're real nice. Found a little shit, did you? Yep. <laughs> I got him. Very good. Welcome to your new home. Hope you're real happy here. <sighs> You want me to make him talk? Oh, no. Now all we'll get is lies. Uncle, Mr. Williamson, tie this maggot up someplace safe. We get him hungry first. I got a saying, my friend. We shoot fellas as need shooting. Save fellas as need saving. And feed them as need feeding. We are going to find out what you need. I can't believe it. An O'Driscoll in my camp. No, I ain't an O'Driscoll, mister. I, I hate that fella. Oh, whatever you say, son. Well done, Arthur. I'm just sorry we missed out on Cole. Oh, there's time enough for that. Now. I did it. I got to figure out if we can hit that train. Okay. Mission complete. You guys can barely see it, but we have completed that mission, old friends. And I think the next mission after this is most likely going to be a robbery, but it looks like it's not available just yet. It might be something we do later down the road, but so far, dudes, that is just the beginning. So the first mission, we got the prologue and the first mission, old friends of the way. Old friends was the more action packed one. Now I'm we got to speak to Pearson and learn how to hunt. Let's jump into it. We're okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what, 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what I you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. 
We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. Oof. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found enough, enough of this. We'll go find something. That's right. Let's do it. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving will be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. <coughs> Here, you take this. Ooh. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. We got the ball. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. All right, dudes. You're never too old to learn. I imagine. Stop here a second. I see something. Uh, careful. Uh, there's deer been here. And recently. How can you tell? How can you not? Stay low and move slowly. Right, time to find some deers, dudes. You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. Oh, look at that. It's easier in the snow, but once you get your eye in, you'll be able to track the milk as well in grass and wood. Thing across all the way over there. Okay. If you guys see when I press my left analog stick and my right analog stick to do L3 and R3, I lose a little bit of that uh, that meter on the above my mini map. It looks like we're tracking the animal right now. We're following its trail, dudes. Ooh. See it? Wait, look. There they are. They? Are you ready with that bow? They're multiple. Try to hit them in the neck or head. Quick and clean. Neck or head? You can pull back quite hard. You'll feel when it's too much. Now, Arthur. Oh my god. Good shot. Let's you know, go! Hunt another. hunt another deer? Bro, we got food for days from that deer. What is that? Deer, huh? It's two deer. If you move closer, maybe? I could hit this. Uh -oh. oh. Okay, so if you hold R2 to, for too long, it's really bad. That's I missed. Okay. Try again. You're making yourself too obvious. Dang, dudes. Hunting's hard. And these deers are far. Oh no, it's too much. Ugh. Well, I'm out of stamina, that's why. Oh, I see. So I was having some struggle. I was having some troubles um properly like shooting the bow, and I realized it's because my stamina was so low. I didn't have enough stamina to like hold the bow back. 
Luckily me. Luckily not for me. I have some stuff that gives me uh, stamina. And I just had to make sure I had it. So if you guys ever are trying to uh, get your stamina up, just eat some baked beans or anything that gives you stamina so you can shoot when you're hunting. It's just good to know. What? How did that not hit? Got ourselves a deer. Careful. This might be our only chance for a good meal. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. All right. Hunting's hard, dudes. Hunting is hard. You sure your hands okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Okay. I'll go grab the other one. Hunting is not easy. You have to have the stamina for it, and you have to make sure you have a pretty good shot on its head. The best way to kill deer is a headshot or neck shot. What is it with your Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Nah, I've heard a lot of talk about them. Well, we've been scrapping over scores with them for years. Big gang, nasty sons of bitches. Their leader, Comb, and Dutch go way back. And not in a good way. A proper blood feud. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Oh my. Let's see if we can find another way around. He's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. Bro. I'm hey, killing the bear, brothers. Oh wait, what? Where's my where's my gun? Ah! Need a gun. Let's go. You and me, baby. We killing this bear right here, right now. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There he is. That's a bad idea. Have you seen the size of it? What are you doing? Look out! So we made it back to camp. We got the two deers from hunting and we're ready to get the monies. Well, I guess you don't really make money because you're not. Yeah, you don't make money. You're, we're just feeding the camp, actually. All right, let's hitch these horses and let's go ahead and serve these bad boys up to the camp. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the boat properly. I only showed you a little. It takes a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well. Can I like drop it over here somewhere? Just drop it down in here. Oh, perfect. There you go. What a surprise. You find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. Why, he loves me really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Well, see you gents later. This dude's always drunk. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. <laughs> you go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? Ooh. It's easier if we do it together. I'll get to skin you. <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you, you dumped on the floor there. So we get to skin the deer for the first time right here, dudes. Let's skin it. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh! Oh, that... That is... Huh. Hmm. Not too bad, Mr. Morgan. That's something. Yeah. They always said you were a butcher. That's you something. Know, you could trade these or sell these in pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, that, if you catch that was anything something. else, you bring it to me. Sure. 
Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. <coughs> yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> <coughs> Woo, a few days later. My God, Master Hunter Morgan, dude, that's me. That is me. It's been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Ooh, baby. Levictus Cornwall. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You're still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Oh, no! Come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. Dude. See me now. He looks so cute. What's left of me? What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now. Oh, come on. Where's man. the love, Abigail? Yeah. Now, you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. Come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which stick was to, to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? We gotta rob the train, Leviticus guys. We got Cornwall's the we got the plans. Dutch, well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, Sounds I'm like he's got him. money. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. That's what I'm Dutch. thinking. Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Yes! Let's go! All right, dude. So after this train robbery, we'll conclude this video. Right. This will be fun. We're moving out. Follow me. Let's go, dudes. All right, dudes, this is gonna be a familiar shot to most of you guys. And it looks like there's someone already down there. Oh, is Bill there? Yeah. You wanna head down, see how he's getting on? Okay. Right, let's go down there and check on Bill. The safest route possible without breaking our horse's legs. And we're looking good. Yep, look familiar, guys. These are the screenshots okay. we saw. You sure? Of course. Can I help a little? All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. All right, pick up the spool. And sounds like a pretty easy job. We just walk the wire to the detonator right at this rock. Pretty easy job. I don't think I can mess this one up, to be honest. I'm really glad we found all that dynamite and connect the wire. Pretty easy. Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. We're good to go, Dutch. We're good to go. Okay, I think so. Okay, cover your faces. The train should be here any minute now. Cover your face, Arthur. All right, dudes. The moment we've all been waiting for. The train robbery. I'm excited. We're going to see what happens here. Gentlemen. It's, it's go time. time. Good luck. All of you. You 
all know what to do. I messed something up, dudes. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. It was my fault. Come on. You're pathetic. You know that? Are you kidding me? What did I do wrong? <laughs> How did I get that wrong? <laughs> Rip. <laughs> go, 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 jump. Well, lost one. We knew that was going to happen. Now we're going to help this guy up. Come on, Lenny. Come on, Lenny. Get up. I should have probably brought my shotgun. Easy. Oof. Oh, bud. What you doing there, right. bud? Yeah, I'm good. What the hell was Bill doing? He had long enough to set that off. Well, mm. I hooked up the wire, but we won't mention that. Ooh, wait, maybe I should loot these guys. Hold on. Do I have time to loot all these? I think so. I don't think there's a deadline. Let me loot them real quick. Alright, time to move up. Let's go get it. Let's, uh, let's get to the front of the train so now. I know what happens here. This dude comes out from right here. He attacks me. I knew it. I knew that was going to happen. Train engineer is being stupid. I got a clear shot. I'm gonna beat this dude, this Abraham Lincoln looking mother trucker. Oh, no. Oh my god, I almost jumped off. Come on, let's get to the front. All right, let's stop the train. Holy. I almost killed myself. Hey, there's more guys? So many guys, holy. Uh oh. Oh! I'm reloading! Okay, I'm gonna die if I don't get over here. Gonna eat some crackers real quick, we're good to go. Alright, hello everybody, I'm back! Dang, dude, we did it. We freaking yes. did it. Let's get the money and go. We got some fellas holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Where are they at? Listen to me. We don't want to kill anyone. We just killed like 50 people. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our Okay, you asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four, three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. What are we doing? Wake them up a little. Ooh, let me reload fully. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. 
Okay. Now, it don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Off the boot. Look at that, dudes. All right, better run. Unless run. You've got a death wish. I'd step back, fellas. <laughs> All right, let's get it. All right, come on. Just walk on out here. <laughs> we don't want to kill you. My, oh we just want to rob your boss. There we go. Come on out, boys. Search that train. Pretty easy job. Let me tell you. All right, now before I search this private car, I think I have to actually. I don't. I'm gonna I'm gonna loot some of the guys that we've killed, just because I don't know if we'll have time to loot them after. And I might need some of this stuff. I think I think looting, especially all these corpses. Is really important, but I'm not sure because I don't know like the functions of the game yet. It's something you'll find out over time. I don't know how important it is to loot these guys. I am getting notifications to go to the, like to the the private car. And I know there's a lot of loot on the general train as a whole. So look at this place. <laughs> it's like a palace. Now I've seen everything. Oh, well, this is a nice say, car. Oh yes, should be easy. Ooh, what is this paper? <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? I'm parched. What's this? Up? Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you. Here's a Cornwall where you have to receive a pay. $2,000? I'll give you that. What? Oh my god. Okay, let's see if we can get this. Put it away. Sugar Premium cigarettes? That's $25? Some what? Some new boat he's ordered from Europe. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. Oh, this looks like an important safe. Now we're in business, boys. We're in business. Those are bonds. Hell yeah. What else we got in here? That's about it, I think. Dang, now it's nighttime? Bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we can probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us. Okay. See you back at camp. Oh, my God. Now, I have, to, I have to decide what to do with these guys? The rest of you, let's ride. Okay. Get on the train, quick! All of you. Any bright ideas? I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. If I hear so much as a footstep from this car, you'll end up like all. Get your in the train, dude! What are you doing? We let. I guess we let these guys live. I'm a little confused because I sort of want to let as many people live as possible that need to live. I feel like the more people I let live, the more conflict I'll have in my story. If I kill a bunch of people that no one knows about that I killed them, it sort of ends the story for me. And I mentioned this earlier. It's sort of like weird to kill people that don't need to be killed. Ooh, piano. We're going to search all these drawers, get as much stuff as possible. Thing is, like, I don't know if this place has anything valuable in it, but I need as much stuff as I can possibly get, you know? Oh, we just picked up a guard on accident. Oh, we're good. So it's cool. So after I did the train robbery, we got a lot of guys to loot. And they let you loot them. When I was doing my commentaries before, I was under the impression that a few hundred dollars was a lot. But in like our first playthrough, we're already at like 58 bucks. That's a like, we've made a lot of money already. Uh, which is crazy because I didn't expect money to be so easily um, obtained in this game. But it's pretty simple to get money. Ooh, wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Look at this. I'm just on this train and there's just coin on the floor. 25 cents just chilling on the, on this in here. I will say one thing I've noticed is that the gameplay feels... Uh, I don't know if the word slow is correct, but it feels like... But did, did we run over a guy? Is there a guy underneath the train? I think there is. It feels like it's smooth and very, like, slow. Yeah, I don't know if slow is the right word. That's the issue. It feels good. It also feels like everything I do is calculated, which is different from the GTA 5 feel. I know this is a GTA 5, by the way, but I'm just saying from their previous title. <laughs> All 
All right. So we let see. We let the train off. Cool. So we getting out of this hellhole? We're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed the Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know We've got a lot of money in our pockets. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well, then let's go. Clean noses Dang, and everything John's else. jacked up, Arthur, dudes. you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. Dudes. <sighs> what a great start. Like, it started off with lots of action and it covered all the fundamentals. Hunting, sneaking, uh, killing. Dude, it's just great. This is great. This is great. First two hours, really good. We did a train robbery. We went hunting. We just did all of it. We did a lot so far. And it's just the beginning. We're like not even 1% of the game completed. I'm super happy. I'm super happy for this opportunity to play this game early. Uh, it's just great. I love it. This is so awesome. So awesome. Get over here! Yes, boss. You two ride up ahead, make sure there's no surprises. We've had enough of those. Me? With the boy? Just go. Come on, kid. You can buy me a whiskey. Well, 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 dudes. You all right back there? Does everything look all right? Well, what's going on? Ah, I broke the goddamn wheel. All right, let's get it fixed. You need help? I reckon we can handle it. All right, Charles, you and me hold the thing up while you try and put the wheel back That's on. crazy, dude. We broke the wheel so first time using the freaking so caravan. I'm just saying. Don't say less. Hit the wheel. There we go. Get in there. You're almost in. Perfect. See? You ain't so useless after all. <laughs> Not quite. Uh-oh. Oh, no. What do you think? If they wanted trouble, we wouldn't have seen them. Poor bastards. We really screwed them over down here. Come on, let's not push our luck. What happened? Well, get in. I'll tell Poor you. Indians. We done took their lands, brothers. Get back in the wagon. Not too far now. Stay on this trail. We'll follow the river, then cut left inland. Get up there. Oh get God! Up. Oh no! Yes. Oh my God! The this thing is so sensitive. Sold a very raw deal. This is the heartlands we're going to. Good farming and grazing country. They lost it all. Stole them clean away from them. It was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our blockheaded driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. 
Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just cause it sounds fancy don't mean he knows a damn thing about what he's talking about. What are you working on there, anyway? Just some yarrow and ginseng. Good for the health. Better than that stuff you buy in the store. Yeah, you can have all this. I'm at the point where I can do it with my eyes closed. Oh, okay. Thank you. Yeah. Here we are, gentlemen. Home sweet home. All right, dudes. We have made it to our destination. I also ran over a tree. I hope so. Gentlemen, we have survived. For now. Now it is time to prosper. Arthur and I were about to prosper in Blackwater. We were onto something big. Then Micah got you all excited about that ferry, and here we are. We have all made mistakes over the years, Jose. Every last one of us. But I kept us together, kept us alive. Kept the nooses off our neck. I guess I'm just worried. I ain't got that long, Dutch. I, I want folks safe before I go. Me too. And now we are stuck east of the Grizzlies and out of money. And Aren't we just robbed them from a dream of virgin land in the West. I know, my brother. But we are safe. We make a bit of money here. Then we move again. Head out around them. Be west of Uncle Sam. In a few months, buy some land. Boom, baby. I hope so. Would you just look around you? This world has its consolations. <laughs> Gentlemen, I'm going to head into the local town and, uh, you know, see if I can strike up a little business. Of course, Herr Strauss. I prefer robbing banks to usury. Seems more dignified somehow. Already robbing banks, dude. dude yeah. that's, be, that's crazy. Everyone, put your tools down for a moment. Come on, gather around. All right. Quickly now. I know that things have been tough, but we are safe now, and we are far too poor. So it is time for everyone to get to work. Get to work, but stay out of trouble. Remember, we are itinerant workers. Laid off when they shut down our factory to the north. Now get out there and see what you can find. Uncle, Reverend Swanson, no more passengers. <laughs> it is time. For everyone to earn their keep. There is a town a little way down the track named of Valentine. Livestock town, all mud and morons, if I remember right. That seems a decent place to start. And, uh, we need food. Real food. That means every day. One of you. And remember, whatever it is that you find, the camp gets its slice. Now be sensible out there. Now, the girls have your tent ready, Mr. Morgan. Come with me. You two will be ready shortly. We put you over here. I'm sure everything will be fine, Miss Grimshaw. It should be. Most of your stuff from Blackwater got saved. Everything apart from my money. Oh, don't remind me. Well, we can always make more money. We're gonna have to. Miss Jackson, I've seen shit with more common sense than you. Do it properly. All right, dudes, that concludes chapter one. This has been a two hour let's play of the beginning of Red Dead Redemption 2. On the channel, you'll be able to find way more videos. If you watched all the way to the end, let me know in the comment section. We're going to end it right here. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, thank you so much for tuning in. It's been a crazy, crazy adventure. And as you can see, we're now in the heartlands. This far east in many years. It's going to be a crazy few that weeks, months, better. and years. His eyes are sparkling once more. He's writing in his journal, he's dudes. Thinking a little clearer. I think we all feel a little happier. Oh, my goodness. Out of black water and that whole mess. Hi there. Jose. Yeah. 
Quite a day. Let's hope so. There's a bunch of the boys already in Valentine. Bill, Charles, and Javier. And Swanson found something down at the train station by the lake, apparently. And Strauss came back with that creepy little smile on his face. I'm sure there's a whole list of unfortunates he's forced money upon. <laughs> Thank you. And you? I'm gonna read a book. <laughs> So, dudes, we have now unlocked free roam in Red Dead Redemption 2. This has been two hours of gameplay, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it from the prologue all the way to this point where we now are at our official camp. Morning, and uh, it's going to be exciting. So hopefully you guys are ready for the future. I am, and I'll see you guys later on today with a brand new video. We're uploading a ton of videos today, so look forward to it.